All right, y'all. So that's the swatch here. I had a little bit of an interruption. Caleb was acting. So yes, that's the swatch there of the highlight. Yes, God. Yes, honey. But yes, this was um about I want to say two forty nine or two ninety nine. But very very well worth the money. I came across this one essence lipstick and this is in dare to wear number three and this looks like this this real pretty mauvey sexy red yes child and i've been on a red lipstick kick lately i'm gonna have to make a video i just nicked the lipstick child no but anyhow i'm gonna have to make a video on my red lipsticks to let you guys see what i do own um and then this was just interesting with me it says it works with any essence nail polish and this is the essence nail art shake me i'm pretty top coat and it looks like that and you can see all the little sparkles in it and i guess you're supposed to be able to put it over essence nail polish and I don't know. I guess it's supposed to work some type of magic. I just got it because it was like 99 cent and it just looked interesting to me. I do own a couple of Essence nail polishes. So, hey, if it all works, we'll see what happens with that. Okay, on to my last things from Ulta. Well, one of them ain't from Ulta, but I'm going to just put it with the two that are. It's from CVS, but yeah. Um, I have two of the new NYX Intense Lip Butters. And they were so picked over, y'all. I was upset because I've been wanting to get these since they came out because you guys, I, I love the Lip Butters by NYX. I absolutely love them. I'm still collecting some of them now. So yeah, so when they came out with the Intense ones, I was like, oh, game on, I got, I got to get them. So I'll probably end up ordering the rest offline, but, um. The two colors that I did get are Spice Cake. And I'll swatch this for y'all. There's a swatch of Spice Cake right there. Very pretty. Very pretty color. Um, and I also got the infamous Tress Ledges. Child, yes, I had this on right now <laughs> with a Jordana lip liner. Love it. Have worn it a couple of times. Very nice pinky nudie color. See that right there? Yes. If you ain't got trust leches in your life, chow. I mean, when I first seen the videos that people put up of this collection, this was the one that I said I got to have it. Yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. On to the one that I purchased from CVS. This is a soft matte, matte lip cream <laughs> by NYX. And this is called Marty Carlo, which is one that I've been wanting for a long time and just hadn't picked it up. But it's a nice, deep, blue-based red, y'all. Yes, yes. You can't tell me you're not feeling that. That is so pretty. I love it. I wore it yesterday. Actually, it's in a video. In my previous video, that's the color that I was wearing. In love with that. Okay, to end this haul, we're going to go to Walgreens, y'all. Finally, huh? Well, that's what editing is for. <laughs> so, the first thing I picked up is the L'Oreal Pore Manager. And it's by the Youth Code brand. And this is just a little travel size. I have used this and I can say that it has a greasiness to it that I don't care for. Um, I like the Miracle Blur um, better, but yeah, for real though. But I did want to try that. So I picked it up and it was like six, seven dollars for the little travel size and it does blur out pretty good, though, with the pores. It does a pretty good job of blurring them out, in my opinion. Um, I did see a difference. Um, I just don't like the greasy effect of it. I prefer a more silicone-based primer, 
or something that doesn't is not going to bring any oils into the skin. So the last three things that I got were two Wet n Wild. These are the lip tints, the Mega Slick lip tints, and these are new ones in which the little stand that I got it off of is that they were limited edition. So these are two. They had other colors, but these are just the two that I wanted. And I got Don't Don't Be Jelly, and it's this purple color. And then I also got Place Sheer. Place sheer bets. Place sheer bets. Place sheer bets. So it's probably more of a sheer color, but it's like a pinky, nudie looking color. So I picked that up. And the last thing I got um, is this Mulani Brilliant Shine Lip Gloss. And I have like a whole collection of these, y'all. <laughs> the first ones, but this is actually a new one. That's out and this is their metallic line of these I believe and this one is in Capri and it's like a purpley shiny like color and um, I'm gonna swatch it there's a swatch of it right there real metallic y'all y'all know I don't really care for things that have chunks of glitter in it and all that kind of stuff so uh, I probably won't buy any more. I don't I'm, I'm not going to say I just don't like it, but I probably won't buy any more of these particular ones. But it is pretty. However, they had a bunch of other pretty colors as well, but I just wanted to test out one to see how I felt about them. So, yeah. That is my haul, y'all. Long drawn out kids everywhere, people running around on my nerves. But <laughs> I wanted to bring this to you guys because um, I haven't done this in so long. And I could go over things and things that I bought, but this was just the more recent stuff, majority of it that I purchased. So I wanted you guys to be a part of that because, you know, when we have our addictions, we got to make other people a part of them. That's part of YouTube life. You know how we do, you know. But anyways, I appreciate you guys sticking with me through this long haul for the ones of you that made it all the way into the end. Um, yeah, um, remember, rate, comment if you have any questions about the products. If you would like to see a video on anything, let me know. Subscribe. And as always, I appreciate you guys' support. I love you guys. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye, y'all. Oh, Lord.